Okay, let's get exploring and then we'll be done with the evening. Shouldn't be too long. Uh, who do we have as options? Elisa and Crow and Milliam. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on. What's my link set? Oh, I really need to do Milliam, don't I? No. Everyone else is doing too well, man. Milliam is just so far behind everybody else. It's absurd. Okay, well, let's do an explore first, and then we can go do what we need to. Okay. Cake. Why? What? I mean, there won't be anything here, so we can ignore that. Uh, oh, yes. I would like to exchange what I can. 24,400. It's so expensive still. I'll have to pass. Why are they 20k? What were they thinking? Like, who's going to be able to afford that until, like, the very end of the game? About farming like mad. We sure did. Uh, I think it's pretty simple. It's because we took it out. Yeah, that makes sense. Ooh, this is different. It was too easy. I thought it was a random noblewoman, so I was ignoring it. You're going to end up with something either absurd or boring, yeah. We're getting it, don't worry. Oh. Okay, that makes perfect sense, madam. Okay. That makes sense, Ramsey. I accept it. It's perfectly reasonable. Upstairs. Still nobody up here. But we have Vincent and uh, Ferris. Right. Because he's having fun. Yeah, it does. I mean, you should be happy to have a brother who cares to spend so much time with you. I'm glad that she's not corrupted at all. It's funny. The previous novelist we had in the series was called fucking Purity. So when you compare that to her... Right, Emma. Huh? Errol, you confuse me. I, I just... Yeah. Like... I think you're just a meme, but I don't know. And it's infuriating. Uh, there's a few.
She's literally going to give us the exact idea we're going to use. Trust me, Usus, it's going to be extravagantly painful. He has a lot of books here, actually, yeah. How many do I have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, we're over halfway. That's good. Oh, not here. Let's see. Uh, which ones are we missing for you? Uh, can we make any? Is the real question. Milk porridge. We can make this. We couldn't before. We can make a single milk porridge. Come on, Reem. Okay, Fuck it up. God damn it, Reen. When we want you to be terrible, you won't be. Uh, custard pudding. Fuck it up for us, Reen. Okay, let's give this a try. Only one go. Mm. Fuck. Okay. You have a few goes at this one at least. Fuck it up okay, for us, Reen. Give this a try. That's right. That's why we love you. You're a failure when you need to be, and a success when you don't need to be. What? No, hold on. That, that would be the same. Um, your grace, Reen, your great. That's a trail in the sky is what it is. Hello, Elisa, we can't hang out. Okay. Yeah, bring a Usus along. Uh, make him skip his field study for once. Actually do something useful instead of the fucking field studies. Which we all seem to love for some reason. Patrick! Oh, you have a scene! Is this Celestin? Because of Elise. Is he willing to talk to Reen because of Elise? Okay. Is he not a lowborn commoner? Okay. We'll get right on that for you, Patrick. Because you have great character growth, and we like that. Very appreciative. Okay, about standard. Okay, uh, now we have Trista in the main building. Let's do the main building. It'll probably be mostly empty, and we can just evade, evade the main story. What the fuck? It's so many people. Huh. Sure, Nate Hard. Why would you declare that? We don't know if next month it'll pop up again or not. They would. 
Get to work, Mint. I support you. What a brat, indeed. How about you, Heinrich? How do you feel? Uh-huh. It's an idol show. Beatrix. She's not napping at all. You really don't need an excuse for you. Just sleep away. Have fun. There's only three people on this floor. Well, two even. What the hell? What? Okay, I've never seen that before. Crow, why are you in here? Okay. I really would like to spend time with you, Crow, but I can't. Blame the fucking game design. Clara, you, you're not- what? You're not sitting there? That's a rarity. In fact, that's nigh unheard of. I would never have expected it. Nobody upstairs. Okay, let's head to Trista. Zooming out. Uh, not too many people outside. Hello, random lower class student. These some tea cake things. Okay. That's not that bad. There's three people here, Becky. He's going to be so more successful. Trust me. You have a better idea, but you're not going to do it as well. Okay, I would usually go in here next, but it does have the quest. Actually, that's fine. The quest will just take me back to Patrick. Nice. Well, if you came here, you easily could. You would have been in this dorm, Reen. I'm Sharon. Okay. We don't have anything else for you, I'm afraid. <laughs> okay, you're insane. How will Tizel react to this? I'm actually unsure. That's actually curious. I didn't think of it. Hmm. Why would she?
Simple enough. Is Mr. Lake Lord here? He seems to be. They're really struggling here. They're really struggling here. So his arc wasn't... Yeah, okay. His arc wasn't about, um... Getting outside more. It was about fixing his parents' marriage. This is before the referendum, so you should be able to leave. Uh, hmm. I guess now he's technically, potentially not in Crossbell any well, the city anymore. Because maybe now, maybe in canon now is when he's being forced to the shack. He doesn't need to do anything for you, he's a child. All fits there. Okay, Milliam, it will be your turn. Right. Uh, we do have more people to talk to. Okay. Oh, yeah, let's go talk to them. What? That's what she was doing earlier, I guess. I don't think that's cooking, that's more ornamentation of food. That's very sad, Colette. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You need new clothes to not go naked. Yep, that sounds about right. We've already done all this. Uh, next stop. Brandon. Garten. Okay, nothing of note. Next stop. Uh, Kirsch's. That's right, bread. Okay. I feel bad for Abbott constantly worrying about all this. Makes sense, though, I'd be in the same position. You will. 12 years at this point, Dolly. 12. Celine, yeah. She wants milk. Are there any milk left? Seven. Okay, we're fine. I have given her milk every occasion I found. I hope it's enough. Misty's here. This is interesting.
Okay. She's getting ready to enact her master plan as the second Anguis, everybody. I hope you're ready for some evil. I sure am. Okay, they're at this again. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Guys, how do you not notice us? I'm happy for you, though. Next. Yep. Koval is Toby. It's shocking, isn't it? Wow. I never would have guessed. I didn't figure this out ages ago, no. Okay, we can afford these now. Oh, uh, we can aff Let's just buy these. Oh my god. Why is this an option? Okay, well that's talking to everyone but the dorm. Let's go. Sara. Upstairs. It's empty. Upstairs. It's empty. It's Elliston and Sharon. Sharon's alone. That's simple enough. Okay. Hey, Celestine, my man. You okay? Uh huh. He's a genius. I like him a lot, honestly. He also has a unique model, like a really unique one. It's also because of police. Okay. Right. Makes sense. The card on the left. Okay, we're going to war. Yeah, he's gonna be a fucking top tier fighter or something. Right. Right. This is good. I really do like him. It's He's still a bit suspicious because he's got glasses, but you know.
Sure. That was a nice conversation. I love the man. Celestine, my man, uh, you in here now? No, okay, if he's not in here, he's nowhere. For now, we have to just accept he's gone. Patrick, uh, Celestine be very busy. What's on his plate? <laughs> Still blue. Cool. <laughs> right. How good is it? Oh, it's fifty. That's pretty good. That's better than uh, mine three, honestly. Right, Milliam, you're next. Only a month, huh? bit salty? I mean, it's sensible. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like the salty cookie, and you're the salt? Huh? Right. Level three, nice. I do need to just keep level leveling her up where I can. Sure. Um, well, now we have to go to Toa. Right, Toa, what do you have for us? Sure. Knock, knock, huh? knock. Doesn't sound like she's here yet. Oh. It's voiced, interestingly. Oh. Oh. <sighs> At least she's getting some rest. Must be a rare treat for her. It's weird that she's only five years younger than me what in terms do, of though? her age. She I looks like bad about waking her. so much younger. Uh -huh. Letting her sleep is the choice that's pleasant, but this the is better for her. She might not want to be left yeah, like this either. she'd be unhappy. Still, she seems really cozy napping there. So I don't want to just jar her awake or anything. Wake Sorry, her up. But if I don't wake you up, I could end up being here all night. That's nice. Yeah, I don't think I can bring myself to do it after all. She must be really tired. I should let her sleep a while longer. Oh, right. Take some time to read or something. Oh my god. There we go. He's too I'll fucking nice. Book or something while I'm waiting. This is really a nice scene though. Drop the jacket. It's expensive. No, don't shrug it off. Jacket? Oh. Yep. Um... Oh, hey, you're awake. Huh? Neem? Oh, right. I came here after the conference was over. 
So this jacket is... Oh no, I'm so sorry. Hey, you didn't drop it. It's all good. I can't believe I fell asleep after asking you to come all the way here. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You're doing me a favor. What do you? I appreciate you taking the time out of your schedule for me. Oh, why is it that you always seem to catch me at the weirdest moments? Still. What? <laughs> you were sleeping Thanks. for quite a while. What? No problem. Glad to do what I can. She meant to be it holding the hot, jacket? No, of course not. It felt really nice and warm. But, uh -huh. but anyway, th that's not the point. Now, listen here, Reen. Huh? I, I mean, lending me your jacket was very sweet and gentlemanly of you, and I'm kind of happy you did. But it's not very gentlemanly to sit and stare at a girl when she's sleeping, you know. Uh, it can be. I'm sorry. I did try to wake you up once, but you seemed so relaxed and peaceful that it would have been almost too cruel to go through with it. But I guess it was inconsiderate of me to just let you nap there. No, 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 no! I'm not annoyed with you. It's just kind of weird to randomly watch people sleep, you know? Yeah, that's why I didn't if watch B. Else, they might have misunderstood. Problem is, I was meant to be in this room with you, so it was more waiting, you know? Reen was just waiting, not watching. so I could show you more about the concert we put on for last year's festival. Oh, you mean the one you did with Angelica, Crow, and George? Do you have some record of it here? <laughs> Actually, I do. George was testing out some kind of orbital video camera that was being developed by the Ruhr Institute of Technology. And we've still got the recording here. An orbital video camera? Jesus Christ, it's yeah, getting too advanced. It's different from what they use for the orbital net. Actually, it's probably faster to just show you. Let me bring it up on the screen. But it's more impressed they managed to get it on screen oh, as well. Pictures of it. <laughs> more than just pictures. Just watch. Oh boy, it's going to be an actual <laughs> idol performance. I know, right? It plays back images and sound at the same time. So it's like a radio and a camera combined. And it's in color well, immediately. It there, bro, but it really feels like you're right there, doesn't it? <laughs> it's really something else. <laughs> Going to see it now, okay. Oh my fucking god. Well, she looks like Tio a lot, honestly. Isn't it cool? It's called Rap. It's making a splash in the music scene abroad. Okay, so it wasn't an idol performance, but it was a rock performance. Sure. Okay, I don't. My guitars for it. It's a pretty bold sound, huh? I'm just not gonna think about it. It definitely is. And, what sound? Uh, Speaking of bold, how about that outfit? Uh, I forgot about the outfit. D don't look at that. Just focus on the performance. Okay. Jesus. There's no performance though. Still look like Tio. Oh, that's the opening. This is a different opening. It's one of the openings. Bravo! That was incredible. Sure, Green, sure. I wish I could have been there to see it in person. We gotta do a rock performance as a class. There's no way. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, so was that any help? Help? This is exactly what I was looking for. How are you going to prepare? You have like a month to teach everybody, along with the field study. I'm not sure if we can put together something as flashy as this. But we do have Elliot, and he knows his music, so... Okay, you have one person, have Reen. You have one person out of 11. 10, even, because Crow isn't performing. Glad to hear it. Crow was the one who planned all of this out. So he's the one you should ask about how to put a program like this Never mind. Out. Angie did our choreography, and George got all the instruments together for us. I'm sure they'd help out if you asked. I think I just might. We have to get our preparations for the festival underway. Oh, I put a copy of the video onto this memory course for you, too. Okay. Can you memory ports into the orbital projector here? You can watch the video What? Can I? Time. Why? Maybe you can bring everyone from your class here and show it to them Okay, tomorrow. that's why. It's not like a feature I can do. Thanks for everything, Toa. I mean, I asked you for help, but you really went above and beyond. I don't really know how to thank you. You're always looking out for me, Reen. It's the least I could do.
do. Besides, I'm sure this idea will spark some lively discussion within your class. It's not a done deal yet, but I'm really curious to see how things turn out. Me too. Honestly, at this point, so am I. If it's not an idle thing, it could be interesting. Still a bit weird. Still a bit weird. You know, not not exactly setting appropriate, but they said that already, and it's like, hmm. Hmm. You know? Okay, I'll stretch my imagination for you. What the fuck is that? Is that the memory cord? It's a USB stick! We all liked it, huh? Oh, that's why it's like it's like a novella, a novel. Yep. No, no, it's a mini game, isn't it? Like so would, I think, so would Milliam. Not sure about Claire. <laughs> nice voice there. It's true. We're doing a performance, baby! It's my Sona 4 moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely, fucking lootly. Let's go. It's insane. Absurd. Yeah, let's go. Toa's outfit might raise more than a few questions, too. Tell them to ignore it, and also it's Arben time time. Oh, it's nine already? Arben time should be on soon. Dude, this has to be meaningful. It's been too constant a thing throughout the game, and Misty, too. And him getting stuck is never going to stop. I'm Misty, and this is Radio Trista. And you're the bit second anguish. Very funny. It feels like we're finally getting the break we deserve from a long string of uncomfortably humid nights. That's right. Fall is finally here, and it's brought its cool night breezes and gentle chirping of insects with it. Along with that respite, Erebonians everywhere are turning to their true autumn passions, food and sports. What do all of you out there look forward to when you realize fall's almost here? For me, the temperature. It's Wow, that's classic. Sure, I'll never turn down a Marin also, or a Mont Blanc, but a roasted is the way chestnuts were meant to be. What? What? Okay, I, I don't really get this line. Maybe I'm stupid and don't know enough about alcohol. Over there giving me 
the stink eye. Someone hasn't eaten dinner yet, I'll bet. Why would we why would he be unhappy about that? Oh, I wonder why you're advertising that. But as far as music goes, I'm a sucker for the classics. I still sing along. Ooh, whereabouts of light? That's a classic right there. I stare in disbelief as you fade away. Like a dimming star beneath the coming day. I guess that sort of fits the tune. That was a good try. I can't wait for it to come back though. Some fresh new genres have been gaining popularity lately. Oh now it's in rock immediately again. She really does have a pretty voice. Though I guess you kind of have to in order to be a big opera singer like that. I don't know if singing on the air like that is such a good idea. Yeah, it's not. She's trying to keep her identity under wraps though. It's a good thing she's in anguish so she doesn't care. Up next week. Then another field study over the weekend. Sounds like things I'm, are going to be I'm all in on this usual. theory now. I'd better brace myself for an exhausting week. All in. Second Anguis, here we come. Monday. Monday? Oh, because of the lunch meeting. I was like, oh, we're getting a Monday? We've never done that before. Don't quote me on that one. Everybody's out and about, and Beryl is even talking with someone. What the fuck? There's so many people talking to each other. Woo! Toa! Crow! Angelica! George! Woo! All six! You're gonna do it. Are we doing opera? They just did an operetta. <laughs> no. Realistically, no. Okay, that's two people. That's three. That's four. Just have everybody else sing at once. <laughs> do do epic music with a choir. Right, what is this going to be? Giga Chad moment. Don't do it. We're not going to get Toa too, right? Surely. We're probably not going to get something particularly tasteful either, I'm afraid. And it's Wednesday. Practical exam. What are our limitations this time? Can we at least choose our party? For the first time ever, I think. Now we got one more chance, I think, earlier, but that was a while ago. And if that's the case, it could also not be the case. I don't know why I said if or it. Basically, I don't know. can't be rock with the instruments we have. Oh, he said shit. Fifteen. We're not twenty-three. Like twenty-seven. Sort of true, but not all. Also not, you know. 
to his right, though. It's the final one. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Her again. Oh, fuck's sake. Two? I mean, it has to be the same duo as always, right? Laura doesn't get to fight for ages, though. Maybe we bring Elliot instead of Eusis? Yeah, let's do this. We're fine. We're already set up. She's pointing at her garden. It's time to win, baby. I take it you're all ready? You've been studying and training here half a year now. I think you might finally be able to do it. Now, show me you've got what it takes to pass with flying colors. Cool. Right. Again, didn't actually say the line. Come at me with everything you've got. No one reaches low HP? We did less than- What the fuck? Okay. Right. We have one thing to do then. And that's get fucking moving. He'll just be doing it for himself. I'm not sure it's worth it. Uh, only faint. That's the only realistic choice. Okay, we need to really look through our options here. Because of the turn limit. Oh boy, oh boy. I hate this. Oh, we actually do need to go for Chrono Drive. Uh, this is fine. Uh, definitely go for this, then. Wait, do you have a better art for this? You absolutely do. You're not allowed to do anything but wait. And that sucks. Oh, I need to change. Fuck, I could have given you a CP up. Fuck, that's bad. Uh, yeah, you need to wait. She actually doesn't have any generation because we don't have anyone to generate within this party. I'm an idiot! I'm an idiot! Shit! We need to re reset. We just don't have what we need. Go take some damage. Just don't do anything. Here we go. I'll don't, do don't do anything. It's a pain, but I can't. My turn. She doesn't have much HP at all. Hold on. He's never hitting it. She's never hitting it through this. That's fine. Time for the kid gloves to come off. Go. Okay. Here we go. All right, it's my turn. That works, I guess. Marcus, my turn. The double miss. That was nowhere near enough damage. We, we're not. Oh, okay. We barely did it. You've come a long way. That's that. Let's keep moving. Conditions met. I think. I don't think that was forty turns.
Yes, nice. Fairly simple because of Laura just doing 8k from a normal attack. Really just overwhelmed you. There wasn't much else to it. Even she's tired now. <laughs> Look at them all. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this as well. Look at that poses, man. Why her? She could still probably beat us all if she wanted. Yes, that. Last field study. Let's go. Heimdall again. Could be it. Ruh. Ruh? They're going to Ordis. God, I, why, why, you made me lose Laura and Usis. Fuck. Fine. 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 At least I don't have million. Ah, we can deal with it. Like, it's going to be actually quite difficult, I imagine, without our mega damage dealing god. Uh, Reem can tank now. Oh, interesting. Look at her! Look at her! She's just happy! Like I said... So it wasn't Emir. That does mean we're gonna get a Zeiss arc. It's a genuinely curious choice. I don't know why they chose them. Right, let's beat it. Why did we shake our heads? That was strange. <laughs> You're Woo! Gonna... Rank up, baby! This Only another 79 to go in Aura Jacket. Okay. You did really well, Reen. I'm very worried we're not hitting the max rank. In fact, I suspect we're not. Very sad. Field study day. Huzzah! My favorite part. Leaving. It's 8.20, so we're still waiting on Elliot and Crow, then. Surprising, Elliot. It looks like they nearly pulled an old night ah, on festival mind. performance. It sounds like they've got a general idea of what they want, as far as style goes. You've got a nice sleep. They're both nitpicking the set list and all the little details of the performance itself. I don't know about you guys, but I'm excited. Good for you, Millian. I'm not worried about Elliot, but I can't say I've got an abundance of faith in Crow. Well, be that as it may, we just have to leave it to them for now. Still, I was surprised by what the instructor said last night. What do you think she's cooking up this time? I can only shudder to guess. 
Oh. Oh, before I forget, I want you all to stop by uh -oh. me tomorrow morning before you head out. Both groups, meet me out on the field by 9 a.m. and don't be late. Why? Well, Sarah randomly springing things on us is nothing new. But why delay our departure? It takes eight hours by train to reach Ordis as it is. You're right. If we're still in Trista at 9 a.m., it would be past sundown before we got there. The train ride to Ruwer is over five hours, too. Ideally, we'd all be on the first train out of Trista. How about it, Sharon? But the way you're just standing back there smiling, I'm guessing you know something. It's I hope nice you're looking forward to my unsurprise when we step off the train in Ruwer to see you already there. <laughs> I wouldn't dream of it. I assure you, I'll only be seeing you off this time. She's totally going to be there ahead of us. That's about as sure a bet as you can make. Pretty certain she knows what's going on, too. She's one amazing maid. I feel like I have my own professional chef, too. I feel like there was a misdelivery in the line, if that's the case. Because oh, it didn't sound like she was lying. Overslept. Yo, morning, everyone. It's Elias and Crow. They're here. Why didn't we wake them up? Who knows? Looks like we have everyone now. <sighs> well, we have to meet the instructor at the field by nine, right? We have I don't plenty know what of she time. wants to see us about, but don't worry. We've still got some time left. Anyway, I think we should head out now. I'm sure most of us have some last minute preparations to take care of. True. <laughs> have a safe trip, everyone. My last minute preparations are getting ready to get one more. Red Moon Rose. I missed what Elisa said, but I have the suspicion it's like she's so smiling that she's gonna see us there. Haha. <laughs> Damn it, Sharon. You know, something like that. Okay. Well, let's step out. Remember, we do now need to sort out the equipment for more people again. <laughs> My favorite part. And leave it for now. Okay. See you next time. <laughs>